In this video, I will show you how to connect N8N with Go High Level if you want to use custom APIs. So first of all, you'll need to uh, create a new set of credentials. So if you don't have credentials, you just need to click on the pen here. And then you will be given a host redirect URL. Uh, this you leave it as standard. Uh, that's the client ID that we will need from Go High Level, the client secret key. And here you need to uh, copy and paste this list of uh, scopes. So if you are within the community, you can just copy and paste it. Otherwise, you can uh, pause the screen and then make a screenshot and then type it. So here, this is what you need. So next, you will go to um, marketplace.gohighlevel.com. And then here, you're going to go to create a new app. So these are apps. So you're going to name the app, you leave it private, and you're going to use it for a sub account. And you're going to leave it white listed. Once you've created a new app, you will see a screen like this one. So the app will already be named. Uh, so you just need to select a category tagline that's mandatory. No, no one else will see it, so don't worry too much about that. And then here inside the advanced settings, you will click on us and then here you need to select the scopes. So you need to make sure that the scopes listed in here are strictly identical to the scopes listed in the, in the um, uh, NIN node. Really, really important. If you miss one or if there is an extra space or comma or a spelling mistake, it's not going to work. Uh, so here you're going to need to set the um, redirect URL, so make sure that you press the add button and, they s and then save immediately. It's really important, otherwise this is not going to take it into consideration. And then here you need to click add and you will be given a client ID and then a secret key. That's what you need to copy and paste in here, in the uh, client ID section and client secret key. Then you will click on the uh, connect and then you will be connected to um, uh, go high level. So basically you will be able to use that for a lot of things. Uh, if you check the list of scopes, so I'm not going to modify that. But basically these are all custom APIs that you can use pretty much. So that's really, really uh, useful. It's a lot better than the uh, authentication V1.